Hey foodies, welcome back to our channel guys. So today's recipe is delicious egg goju and it's really good guys so you don't want to miss out on this one. If you guys like eggs, this is one of the perfect recipes for you guys. So let's get going without any further ado. So to make this recipe, you'll need the following ingredients. This recipe recipe serves about 5 to 6 people. So you'll need about 6 eggs, some curry leaves, some coriander, salt, mustard seeds, turmeric, sambar powder, red chili powder, dhania powder, some oil, some onions. We have taken two medium sized onions and tomatoes, like three small tomatoes. So, first let's keep the eggs for boiling. So, you want these eggs to have a hard boiled consistency. So, depending on your flame, make sure you adjust the timing so that your eggs come out hard boiled. Next up, we'll keep a kadai and light it up. So, I want to take a quick mention to tell you about this oil that we use, guys. So, this is pure cold press oil of sunflower seeds. So, most of the oils that we get in the market, they are adulterated with um, a lot of you know unhealthy substances so if you have any access to certain oils like this around your house i do suggest that you use these oils because health wise it's very good next up let's chop up some onions and tomatoes so i have a small request you guys uh, as we all know we're going through a very bad time right now and more than humans these poor animals are suffering a lot so if you are around any street animals like stray dogs or cats or anything or birds please do feed them give them some water give them some biscuits or rice or something like that so that they can survive these times too uh, let's help every everyone we can guys let's do our small bit to the society thank you now let's add in some mustard seeds about 1 to 2 teaspoons um and let them pop guys you don't want to add anything before the seeds pop some people consider this extreme sport so add in some curry leaves and then you want to add in your chopped up onions you've taken two medium sized onions here give it a good mix so pro tip guys i'm sure most of you know this but just in case after adding onions you want to add in some salt because salt helps your onions cook faster because salt kind of pulls out all the water and lets the onions sweat which helps the onions cook a lot faster than it it usually would next up let's add in the tomatoes that we've chopped up As you can see here, our vegetables have uh, cooked down. Now let's add in our spices. I've taken two pinches of turmeric here. We need to add in like two and a half teaspoons of sambar powder. So this powder we make it at our own home. But uh, if you don't have access to your own uh, sambar powder, you can use the store bought ones as well. Let's add in two teaspoons of chili powder, red chili powder. and about 3 teaspoons of dhania powder add in a little salt according to your taste requirements also add in Three fourth glass of water to decrease the consistency a little bit. Now, uh, peel off the eggs and chop them up, like as shown in the video. So once you're done chopping your eggs, 
you want to add them in and give it a gentle mix you guys you don't want to break the eggs apart because when you're eating you want to get all the whole eggs finally add in some chopped up coriander and give it a good mix let it sit on the stove for another 1 to 2 minutes and then you can take it out into a serving bowl oh before that don't forget to taste everything is good serve it up you go guys this is the completed recipe trust me you guys this is so delicious and thank you so much for watching please like share and subscribe to our channel we'll be back with more